Good morning. This is Liz with Liz's Notary Nuggets for for today. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Um, anyway, just wanted to drop by real quick and just mention a couple of things. I often get calls when people will say, I've gotten my notary commission. I passed the NNA exam. What's next? Well, what's next is that you get some training. Passing the NNA exam does not tell you the how to. After you get that training, I highly suggest if you're brand new and you don't already have a relationship with the title company or two that's going to get you started, you use SnapDocs, that's SNAP, S-N-A-P-D-O-C-S, to get you started. Make sure you have a really good um, profile uh, set up on NNA and on SnapDocs and make sure that you opt in on, um, on NNA that just says that you're available for work and then also that you select yes for eDocs and then from there you're going to go to SnapDocs and sign up on Snap on the SnapDocs platform. It is a platform. Oftentimes people will say, well, SnapDocs uh, gives me, uh, they lowball. Well, SnapDocs does not necessarily, um, well, let me just say, SnapDocs is not a signing service. It's a platform that signing services use and they pay for that platform. You, as a signing agent, do not have to pay to be on the SnapDocs platform. However, if you're on SnapDocs, it gives you an opportunity to get signing from uh, nationwide signing services, so your opportunities are greater. Now, when your messages will come to you, your uh, assignments will come to you through SnapDocs in a text message, that means you must be quick on that phone because it's only out there for a few seconds. So if you select yes, you're available for that appointment, then you've got to be willing to go do it. So make sure you've got your training uh, on how to do it before you start accepting assignments through the SnapDocs platform. And then once you get that signing appointment through SnapDocs, you're gonna do the best job that you possibly can. And then when you send the documents back to the hiring company, you're going to include your card and you're going to ask for more business. Ask for more business, but you've got to do a great job in order for them to give you that business. Now, if you're brand new and you are afraid because you think you're going to make a mistake, well, I'm just going to say keep a little bit of that fear but not so much that it paralyzes you. And yes, because we handle so much paper, from time to time, we make mistakes. When you make a mistake, you own it, you fix it. No, you own it, you apologize, you fix it, and you fix it quickly. And they will appreciate that. And then chances are you will continue to get business from uh, that individual company. So you start with SnapDocs, um, often time people say, well, I want to work direct with the title company. And that's all fine and good. You can do that. However, you've got to start somewhere. And when you start working directly with title companies, you have an expense um, as far as your marketing costs are concerned. So you want to be mindful of how much you're going to spend in order to get that business. Start with SnapDocs. It gives you more opportunities. Uh, to get business, and then you're going to do a great job at it, which means the business is just going to keep coming. So that's my nugget for today, and I hope you go out and make it a great day. So see you soon. Bye-bye.